Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Why haven't I received my tax refund yet? When you file your tax return, you typically expect to receive your refund within a certain time frame. However, several factors can delay this process. Filing method. The method you use to file your taxes can significantly impact the speed at which you receive your refund. If you e-file your return, you can generally expect your refund within 21 days. In contrast, paper returns submitted by mail may take four or more weeks to process due to the additional time required for mailing and manual processing. Errors and incomplete information. One common reason for a delayed refund is the presence of errors or incomplete information on your tax return. Numerical errors, incorrect social security numbers, or missing key pieces of information can trigger an IRS review, adding days or weeks to the processing time. Ensuring your return is accurate and complete is crucial to avoid such delays. Tax credits. If you claimed certain tax credits, such as the Earned Income Tax Credit, EITC, or the Additional Child Tax Credit, ACTC, your refund may be delayed. Congress has mandated that the IRS cannot release these refunds before February 15th, with refunds typically expected by the first week of March. Audits and reviews. The IRS can delay your tax refund if it is conducting an audit or review of your return. This is particularly common for returns involving EITC or ACTC from prior years. You may receive a notice indicating that your refund is frozen until the audit is completed. Debt offsets. If you owe federal taxes, back child support, or other debts, the IRS may offset your refund to pay these debts. You will receive a notice from the IRS if this is the case, detailing the amount taken and the reason. Tracking your refund. To stay informed about the status of your refund, you can use the IRS's Where's My Refund tool. This requires your social security number, filing status, and the exact amount of your refund. This tool can provide updates on where your refund is in the processing pipeline. Additional review. Sometimes the IRS may hold your refund for additional review. This does not necessarily mean you are being audited, but it can lead to one if you do not respond with the requested information by the deadline. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.